Hello friends, welcome back to CAD practice. Today we will learn how to make a spinner in Autodesk Inventor. If you have not subscribed our channel, please do that. So let's get started with today's modeling. Take new standard path in MM. Take a 2D sketch on XY plane. Take a circle command of dia 22 okay and give it a distance of 30 give it a constraint of vertical okay now make another circle of dia same 30 uh, 22 now offset the above circle by 6 mm ok take a circular pattern and select both the profiles and select the axis of rotation and give it a account of 3 ok now take 3 point arc select this one and this similar this this and similarly these two okay give tangent relation between this arc and this profile and this profile and this arc <coughs> tangent this and this so this Similarly with this and this one. Okay. Now take equal relation and give between these two. Similarly with these two. Give a radius of 30, uh, 15. It will be very wide. Give it a thirty. Give it a fifteen. Okay. Take extrude command. Select this profile. You know this and this. Give it an extrude of seven. Give extrude um, symmetric. Now take full round fillet command. Select this face, the center face, and the back face. Give it a radius of two mm. The cage is ready. Give it a color of light red. Okay, now save this part. Spin one. And now take a new assembly, standard in MM. Place the uh, presently made part. Okay. Now take origin, <clears throat> take exit plane and of the assembly and constrain it with center axis of this circle. Similarly, now you will take XY plane and XY plane of this. I did by doing it ok so now it started rotating now the bearing is left for that place you have to take from content center the inbuilt library of inventor softwares go to shaft parts bearings ball bearings 
then an angular contact bearings take BS 290 SKF bearing with RS1 seal ok now select the radius and the diameter it will automatically generate a bearing and give it a drop ok so we have selected a wrong face for that go from here take bearings mate and give a mate of minus 7 minus 7 now it's ok so as it's now it's rotating with the spinner outer so now similarly place one more time a bearing ok so do same for this give it a minute of minus 7 ok now for these two take pattern command take circular pattern take center axis as this count of 3 and angle between each is 120 ok so when you do you will see the bearings are not moving with the spinner for that take constraint your constraint of this axis and this axis apply similarly with bearing axis apply now you will say it's perfect so that's all for today's video please like the video and subscribe the channel Thank you.